on the ball, Jensen. Can he find the net? Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Son! My goodness, that... A really intense pressure applied. Can they slot it home? In it goes! At the second time of asking, and the keeper feels hung out to dry. Delivering it into the box. Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. He's driven in the corner. And a fine stop. A wilting under the pressure. And now... They... And a goal here for Tottenham, who have evened things up. Can he take advantage? Defensive roadblock in the way. Save, but still a chance. Kane. Happy to take on the shot. And the keeper throws himself at the ball. Can they grab the lead late on? Kane! Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them? There's every chance. And there goes the final whistle. The overall story is a happy one for Tottenham because they get the three points from this game. Hello everyone, I must say it's always a real privilege to commentate from this venue. A warm welcome to North London. I'm Derek Ray and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Tottenham Hotspur and they take on Southampton. Well thanks Derek, two games in and Spurs will be quite pleased with their performances. They're unbeaten and at times looked a very good team. But I still think they can improve in one or two areas. Let's hope they put in a big performance today. And the starting 11 for Spurs. Jordan Pickford begins in goal. Hyung Min Son plays with Lucas on the flanks. And the striker is the very creative and eye catching Richarlison. And here's how the lineup looks for Southampton. Ainsley Maitland Niles plays alongside James Ward Prowse in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And now they get the ball rolling. Advantage Spurs. Lucas. Richarlison, can he put it away? Richarlison, a truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game, just what they were hoping to produce. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now?
Walker Peters. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Romero. Eric Dyer. Now Romero with it. It's with Porro. Now Dyer. Skip. And Hoybier with it. Well, it's fair to say he's been across all the back pages and the focus of social media as well leading into this game. Playing against his old club and I wonder what's going through his mind, Stuart. Well, he shouldn't approach this differently to any other game. He's just got to forget the crowd and go out and play. Sessegnon. On the ball, Richarlison. Ryan Sessegnon has it. Well, not the pass he had in mind. Pedro Porro. Well, Spurs now in potentially a dangerous position. Good bit of pressing. Out of play for a Southampton throw. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Ward Prowse. And he read it well, intercepting it. Eric Dyer. It's with Porro. Lucas. Hoybier. Can they find a gap in the defence? Good looking pass. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Well, it still could be dangerous. And problem solved for now. And Southampton will get the throw in. And Spurs doing well to win it back. Kyung Min Son. on with the pass but not what he had in mind and he keeps going and thwarted there following the cross Davis Romero it's with Porro now Romero with it. Sessegnon. Lucas is waiting. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Ward Prowse. Well, let's see if something comes of this. Oh, that was begging to be put home, but the goalkeeper has it. Romero. Pedro Porro. Now Dyer.
Hoybier. Bad pass. Onuachu. Now Ben Davis. Sessegnon. Davis. Hoybier. Spraying passes around, almost waiting for the opposition to make a mistake. Richarlison. Doesn't want to lose his cool here. Well, that'll be a free kick. There's been so much speculation in terms of whether the transfer would go ahead, but it will go ahead, Stuart. Yes, it's an exciting move for him, and hopefully we'll now see the best of him. But he'll need to settle in quickly to win over the fans. The move suits everybody, I think. Well, a bad pass it was. Mislav Orsic. Now Romero with it. Pedro Porro. Lucas. And that's great work to make sure it didn't go over the line. Hoybier. And with that, the attack fizzles out. So nearing the break, and Spurs hold the edge. What have you made of their performance to this point? Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield, where they've just started to take control. They'll be fairly happy going in at half-time. Oh, stays... Stewart's a chance! Well, really stout defending there, off the line. Romero couldn't find a teammate throw in here and the right place to cut out the pass and a throw in here for Southampton getting in there to take it away Oliver Skip. And Hoybier with it. I've played with just a bit too much ferocity. And it's going to be a throw in. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Well, possibilities in the centre. A really top-notch piece of defending. Couldn't keep it. Promising looking ball. So a corner kick it'll be following the deflection. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. Oh, great header. Smart stop, though. Not increasing the pressure. Another corner it is.
Can someone get on the end of this? Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Salisu, Armel Belakotchap. The ball with James Ward Prowse. Tremendous block. Surely. And nicely parried away. That's going to be a Southampton ball. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Lucas. A possession lost, intercepted. Half time then here in the English capital. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. So into the second half, Spurs hold the advantage, but it's a long way from being done and dusted. Sessegnon. Using his physical strength to shield it. Walcott. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Hyung Min Son. Walcott. And it's with Maitland Niles. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Sessegnon now Son skip and don't forget we have more Premier League action coming up for you on EA TV it's Tottenham Hotspur facing Fulham really good high press Lucas Moura well that's how to do it inside your own penalty area Well, Tottenham have possession again. Skip. Ryan Sessegnon has it. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready and now they will make the personnel change. Son and he read it superbly and that's very good refereeing to let the play flow they've lost it Pedro Porro. Now Dyer. Q 
Kyung Min Son. And a timely intervention. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. Well, it smacks into the gloves of the goalkeeper. Sessegnon. Now Son. So a half an hour remaining. Son at the ready. And problem solved for now. And don't forget, we have more Premier League action coming up for you on EA TV. It's Southampton facing Everton. And that's an important intervention. Mislav Orsic. Son. Moving it forward. Quick ball to perhaps catch them out. Well, it didn't happen. For the referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. And a substitution in the offing. he'll be a bit cross with himself based on that free kick not the execution he was looking for Walker Peters just failing to hit the target with his pass and it'll be a throw in Genepo. Will it happen for them? This could level it. Well, last gas defending, but brilliant defending. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, a touch off the defender last of all, so a corner. Played over. And a goal! Real excitement here, the equaliser! Well, let's look at this again. It's a decent delivery into the box, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1 1. 20 minutes to go. Son. And scope for them to produce something exciting. And cuts inside. Son! Oh, fine stop. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? Spurs to make a personnel switch now. Who can they pick out? And the keeper left us in no doubt that that was always going to be his ball.
And it's Harry Kane on the run. Lucas Moura. Can he finish? And the keeper more than equal to it. And over it comes. Not a great pass. Can they hit on the break? Using a strength to shield the ball. And the referee blows for a foul. An alert intervention. Oliver Skip. And just failing to bend the run enough. And the flag has been raised. But wasteful from Southampton. Maitland Niles. Genepo. Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up. Well, they still have designs on the win. Well, it didn't go to plan in the end. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. Well, he must proceed with great care. Could easily have been cautioned. And the substitution will occur now. Number 27, Lucas Moura. And number four, Oliver Skip. Coming onto the pitch, 21, Dijan Klufsky. And number 38, Yves Bissouma. And there's the feed into the box. And a struggle to get it away properly. Ward-Prowse. And an astute piece of defending. Bisuma. It's not lost on them what a goal could mean at this late stage. Son! Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Davis. Son! Chance for Son! What a powerful effort, but just wide. And a substitution in the offing. And space for them here on the flank. Can they grab the lead late on? Opportunity to deliver the cross. Well, he stopped them in their tracks.
Kane, he's in behind. Not to be for him. He went for power over placement. Well, you're right. He decided to go for the power, which in the end he couldn't control. He'll be furious with himself. That's a big miss. Good-looking sequence. And players waiting in the centre. Fine cross into the middle. And a time for cool heads. It comes to nothing in the end. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Good looking ball. Getting the better of his opponent. Perisic. Bisuma. Not out of the woods yet. And the keeper hangs on at the second attempt. Well, he's done really well, hasn't he? Great stop and then the reaction. Wasteful from Southampton. It is still level, but Spurs on the attack. Can they break the parity? A fine reading of the situation. And using his strength to shield the ball. Chalet Atsar. The supporters want to see him have a go. And now Perisic. Bisuma. Very quick thinking there. Well, the referee trying to play advantage there, but it wasn't forthcoming. And that's going to be the goalkeeper's ball. And so the final whistle has sounded at the end of the game. The team's not to be divided. From the point of view of the hosts, how did they fare? Well, they did OK today, but they need to start playing with a bit more energy. It's not been a great start to the season for them. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. Played with real authority and attack, Stuart. Yeah, that was a good performance, but then I wouldn't expect anything less. That was a 7 out of 10 display today.